Hi, I'm Liz, the safe site for South Dakota State University and the president of the Campus Women's Coalition. We've been trying to get free condoms on campus ever since we saw the Trojan Sexual Health Report Card and SDSU got an F for condom availability. We talked to student health and they basically told us that they couldn't fit it into the budget, and that's when I saw the Great American Condom Campaign on Facebook. The condoms came in, and we decided to hand them out in the union. That went really well because more people recognized Trojan, and so they trusted them more than Planned Parenthood condoms we'd given out before. About the third time we were handing out condoms in the union, an RA came up to us and asked us to put a safer sex program together for his dorm. We came up with a battle of the sexes type type game where we would make a statement about condoms and each team would decide if it was true or false. One example was that all college students can afford condoms. We explained where they could buy them cheaply or in bulk and that they could get free ones from us tonight. Another example was that some penises are too large for condoms. The guys disagreed that this was false and we explained that, sure, bigger condoms will be more comfortable for bigger penises and that people should experiment to find out what they like. But if what you like are magnums and all that's available are regulars, you should use the regulars because they will stretch. I ended up putting a condom on my arm for 10 minutes to prove that it's safer to have a tight condom on than it is to risk STDs. They believed me after that. Everyone got a free condom at the end, but the winning team, the women, got a few extras. The RA thought it was a great program, and we're really hoping to do it in all of the dorms next year if we can get a fresh supply of condoms. I want to thank you for helping SDSU last semester, and we really hope to work with you again.